What is going on ladies and gentlemen, King's Reaper here and welcome back to episode 2 of Anamnesis. We will continue straight on where we stopped our last game, if the game, of course, allows it. Oh, there we go. Your combo meter cannot reset this turn, that's nice. So that means, basically, if we would be like, let's see, hold on, what do we got? We got this, we got this and this uh, it costs a lot so we'll do this for now hey okay, we're gonna defend perfect oh he did just what oh no oh no we have no defensive cars this time uh i think hold on this costs two mana requires one this blah 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 two two Damn it. So we can hit him for six or eight. And then we no we can't do that. We can't do that either. I guess we can just keep hitting him and that's it. Oh gosh, we'll take five damage. This is gonna hurt like hell. We took seven damage. Perfect. Um so this isn't good. This it, this is actually not good. Oh, it generates one. Perfect. So let's smack him. And let's hit him with this. That should We should get rid of him right there. Okay. Okay, perfect. We get to continue on, but we are so low on HP. Oh my god, this dude is like 40 health now? What? Um, okay, so what do we get to do? Hold on. Strike an enemy for 6 and gain 3 shields. Hmm. He's gonna do... S okay, we can actually go full attack on him. So let's see. What we what do we have? We have this. Hmm. Right. Okay, and do we do this? Hmm. Yeah, why not? Perfect. Oh gosh. 33% less damage with hits. Doesn't affect damage from status effects. Damage cannot be less than one. Lasts three turns. So he's gonna deal four damage to me. But instead, we might actually kill him off. So hold on, we got defensive stance, we got this 18 damage, 15. Why is the game lagging? We'll do this to be sure that we actually kill him this time. Okay. So we got another dude. Uh, I think... So what is it? Your combo meter cannot reset this turn. Does it reset next turn? That's what I wonder. So, we could actually deal some damage and then safeguard. Yeah, I think we're gonna do this. Deal... This... And I have to shield, otherwise I'm dead. Okay. Perfect. Oh, he's gonna do a buff. He's gonna go for a buff. Okay. What? Yeah, but we need full... Okay, so that's useless for now. Um, I think... Hold on. No, we're gonna do this. We're gonna defend right now to gain this status effect as well. So he's also defending. Okay. Why did I not get any defense now? Oh my lord. What do I do? What do I do? Um, Hold on. We could do this. Four times nine damage. He could potentially die. Oh. Or he doesn't die. So we can do 24 burning damage. Or what else can we do? 15. 
So he adds 3 damage reduction. Uh, he's gonna deal 2 damage. I'm gonna survive that. Oh, we can't do that. So we can only do this and nothing else. Okay. We are almost dead. Perfect. So he deals 1 damage. Uh, can Whoa. Can we actually kill him? One, one, one. We maybe could kill him. Let's see. Yeah, he's dead. Perfect. Okay. We are on seven hit offensive combo. So if we do duo, we could potentially kill that guy. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We kill him. And then... He's not going to do anything next turn. That's nice. So maybe go fully attack him with another hit. Nice. Now, basically, if we would get exactly that 90 damage. Ooh, that's a lot. Should we? Should we? Should I? Hmm. This could be maybe combined good with the other card where we don't lose our combo. Even though it states this ends the combo, maybe if we combine it with other card, we wouldn't lose the combo. So, hold on, let's see. This is two mana, one mana, two mana. Should we go like 12 damage, 23? Um, yeah, let's burn him. Nice. He's dead. Overkill. Perfect. And I definitely need a defensive thing right now. Because if I don't get those defense combos... 54. If he hits me for 5, I'm dead. So this is mana cost 0. So we'll hit him. Gain some armor. And then burn all of them limit oh yeah wait what only what? oh god oh god oh god we're dead oh we are so dead uh let's hit him and oh maybe maybe we could survive hold on we could maybe survive we're on one hp how wonderful. Um, let's see. For every card played this turn. Okay, perfect. He's gonna buff up. Mm, okay. He's gonna attack for five. Now he's gonna attack for two, but we have shields up. Good, that's it for now. No, don't do this to me. He's gonna deal one damage and I can't defend myself. Uh, right, well, I guess this is the end of our run. Yup, goodbye, hero. Defeat. We've we have screwed up so bad. So we can now select a memory to keep. So let's see, what are we gonna keep? Strike an enemy four times for nine damage. Requires one. Hmm. I think this is actually quite good. But shield and sword isn't either. It's also bad. It's also bad. It's also good, God damn it! It's not that bad, but... Okay, so... This card, I don't find it that good. Okay, so we are definitely going to keep something else, something better. Do we go with defensives? No, that's something we have already. Mana cost, one. Strike an enemy two times for nine damage. This or this? Hmm. The problem with this one, it requires me to have already some power-ups. So, I guess 
We should go maybe with a cheaper deck. Yeah, let's go with Duo this time. Yes, we're gonna keep this memory. Perfect. Okay, so let's see what we can actually do. Swap it with this one. Yeah, perfect. So we have like six attacking cards and only four defensive cards. What else do we have? Like, that's pretty much it what we can do right now, I guess. There's not much more we can do right now. Okay. Okay, hold on. I have to check why the hell is my computer lagging because I honestly don't understand what's going on right now. Okay guys, we are back. I think I fixed the game and we get to start a new game once again. Death is not the yes, yes, yes. We know it's not the end of the memory. So I guess each run, when you finish, you get to keep some of those cards or you get to keep one of the cards and you can edit your you starter deck. You have returned deck. the afterlife, I see. You have... Mm -hmm. Let's see. Gain a random buff at the start of the next wave. Okay. Enemies start with half HP during the next wave. Choose one of three memories. Let's choose this one. I'll fight. I'll... This sounds fun. <laughs> so enemies start with half HP at each run at each level I'm not sure we'll see okay last one turn okay sure two times six damage this should like pretty much immediately just kill the snake yep good we're done with the snake now we have a snake and a bat okay so Let's see, duos, we should be able to kill the snake again, immediately, nice. And we killed the bat as well, perfect, easy cheesy. Unscratched, uncatched, un, un something. nice. And we immediately get to choose something. So let's see, we have 400 something, we could actually buy a decent card, but... Treasure, event, let's go for a treasure. We, we still have time to buy cards later. Spiritual, gain one spirit at the start of every wave. Okay. I think that's not gonna help me a lot since I don't have cards that actually go with that. I mean, it might help. Oh, that was only for the tower level 1 that enemies start with half HP. Okay, so let's see. Uh, I think we'll do this to start off with. That's gonna last 3 turns. Perfect. They are not gonna deal any damage to me, which is good. I could do 12 damage, 6... And I have two O's as well. So let's do this first on the bat. He's left with four health. So he could do... Hmm, maybe gain one. Yeah, let's gain... Hold on. If I actually attack again... I still have one mana left. So I can kill the bat... And I did get the buff, perfect. So now I can put a shield on and let the snake attack. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So this is gonna last one more turn. Um, should I go full defense and generate the shield? Um, yeah, why not? Perfect, defensive combo. Now it lasts four turns. I should have attacked. I was not thinking straight. Okay, let's hit the snake uh, like this and finish it off. Perfect. Overkill. Love it. Okay, let's keep on pushing to the next level. So they're gonna do one damage. 
or I could go hmm actually I could potentially kill the bat immediately with duo right yep the bat is gone and then we deal hmm yeah let's deal 15 damage to snake or in this case 20 damage perfect now we have a blazing sword as well Ooh, why do I get to skip turn come on unbelievable that snake let's go with overkill that wasn't overkill okay if you say so um let's see so if I hit him the problem is I have nothing to to yeah he's gonna just lose this he's gonna lose his turn and we are on 10 hit combo but I have nothing to do right now with it. there's nothing I can do when it comes to combo right so I can actually start no I can start generating shields okay perfect so do I generate yeah, let's generate the shield because we don't have this thing right now on. Perfect. So for the next three turns, we're going to receive less damage. Good. So now we can start dealing with him. Actually, let's do this. Yeah, perfect. Now he's going to deal one damage. Okay. Um, so we have duos perfect nice another level done what do we get to choose now it's going to be shop and treasure hmm do we go for the shop yeah let's go for the shop this time although I like treasures Let's go for the shop because I need to buy some cards if there's something good. Ooh, this is actually good. We get to deal 18 damage for 2 mana. Nice. Expand all spirits to deal 9 times the spirits in damage to enemies. Okay. So this is strike an enemy for 18 damage, then gain 3. Ooh, we gain immediately that that's 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 actually good and this could actually now go good with our card or with the thing that we have I'm not sure what's it called now so we'll definitely get this we are going to get this as well then I can't get this but I will get flaming because sometimes I'll need to use it against enemies Hmm. Is it worth it? Like, it costs 2 mana, but... Nah, I don't want it. I don't want it. That's it for now. We're gonna leave the shop. Good. Okay. Let's keep on going. Okay. Take only half damage per hit. Shield can be burned away. So we want to burn his thingy away. And then... So we're going to shield up. No, I didn't do this properly. Burn the shield away. Shield up again. But I don't think it's going to stack to the combo now. I don't think it's going to stack. Self-guard? Yeah, not gonna stack. So if I hit him now, I'm gonna lose the combo streak, so I'm not gonna hit him. I'm gonna leave it like this. Okay, give me another shield. Perfect. Safeguard. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, now we can go and do the flickering. Perfect. Okay. I have one spirit. Good. And he's gonna receive three damage. Alright. 
so he's gonna deal one damage I could potentially like shield up and hit him two times yep perfect let's see what do we get ooh a lot of shields let's get that bonus up and yeah we're just gonna shield for now that's it he's gonna die backfire perfect yeah um, we're done okay so now we get a mr. snake let's use immediately defensive stance perfect so that we don't receive as much damage so this is gonna last for one more turn no two more turns um, do we go with yeah I'm gonna extend it even further good 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 now that we have this bonus on five turns I can actually start I'm gonna flame his thing away and that's it yep got nothing else to do okay so we could use flickering perfect and then let's see we got this and this um hmm I think I'm gonna shield up again and then use a normal attack on snake oh yeah so let's see what does the snake do actually this turn what kind of a debuff do we gain nothing okay let's get the snake out of the way good we get that I think I'm gonna end the turn and keep on pushing for that three hit combo Ooh, oh this is nice adds three damage to every hit delivered uh, it should be an overkill I guess yep overkill that's fine okay next room pretty much the same thing I guess how much two more turns um, we are on seven hmm four hit combo and all I have is uh, this thing here but if I use this is it gonna remove the combo I think it's gonna remove it so I don't know like I'm gonna hit him and let's try to use it and see what it does does it remove the combo no it doesn't it actually doesn't remove the combo which is nice I mean we're gonna take two damage here oh no we skipped the turn that's not good that's definitely not good you gotta skip it snake is dead he is dead nice I think I'm playing this bit wrong I should be focusing on getting this up all the time and being in defense because they won't be able to hit me as much okay so far uh, let's let's oh no 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 hold on hold on nine damage let's hit him once like this yeah and then no we can't use it 18 damage 23 nice overkill perfect so actually if we get two offensive attacks for the next run which we do yes we do okay this is really nice so hold on we have flickering and this mm, I think we're gonna hit him like this and then oh no we, got, we don't have the mana oh no oh no um so this last two turns what can we do can we kill him no damn I guess we'll use this and then maybe shield shield up yeah unfortunately I didn't get what I want wanted to get so 
I'm gonna start working on regenerating some HP. Perfect. Good. It lasts for three more turns. That's perfect. Um, defense again. Good. Oh yeah, he dies. Backfire. Wonderful. Okay, well, this isn't actually that bad. Backfire, time 3, overkill, times 2, perfect. So we did earn a lot of focus with which we can buy some new cards as well. Okay, so what do we get? We get a shop, camp, or random event. Uh, I think we'll go to shop. And then we'll start working on regaining some health and draw one memory. Okay. Gain three for every card played this turn. This is actually good. This is that we gain just three stacks of attack damage, which is also good. Four number of combos, which is good. 3-0, not bad. You know what? We need some more defensive stuff. So I'm going to pick this. I'm going to pick this as well. Then let's see. For the number of combos, we could burn them a lot. But this ends the combo streak. Hmm. I think I'm going to get it anyway. It's not that bad. I'm going to get this as well. Because then we instantly gain three combos on the offense. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Hmm, nice. Okay, so we are going to instantly start building our shields up. So that we can actually gain some health. Defensive stance, perfect. Okay, good. Now the snake could screw me over. Oh, good. It did not. Hmm. So I could play like flickering, which is good. That's what we want. And then put a shield on myself. Although I don't understand that card. It should be gain 3 block for every memory played this turn. Lasts one turn. So am I supposed to play that card before I play the other cards? Like, it, I didn't see it work. Because it says including this card. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. 6 armor. Did I lose the combo? It seems like I did lose a combo on that. Okay. Perfect. Defensive stance. Yeah, they're going to keep receiving damage on their own. Shielding, safeguard. Let's use safeguard and shielding as well to regain 6 HP. Nice. That's good. So, what happens... I don't know. We'll see what happens if we use Flickering now. Oh. We did not get it this time. So, let's see. If I use this... Okay. And what happens if we use... Attack this time? Oh, we did gain it. Oh, perfect. I thought we don't gain it. It's it's kind of weird. Mm, flaming sword. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Last three turns. That's nice. Uh, so, let's see. We can kill the snake boy. Or, hold on. This is two mana. Fifteen. Hmm. You better kill the snake boy. Yeah. That's better. Okay. So, I think we're gonna kill him anyways. Let's do this first. Oh yeah, we're gonna kill him. Okay. 
Okay, so we have duos, we have this, and then this. Hmm, they're not gonna do a lot of damage for now, so I'm gonna do two wolves on snake to kill it. Perfect. Overkill, okay. Then we can use this on our guy. If I use this, do I lose the combo? No? Yes? No? I don't know. Let's burn him. No! Oh, that counts towards the offensive combos. Okay. Okay, good to know. Good to know. So, yeah, we're done. We're done with this turn. Perfect. Mmm, flaming sword again. But do we need it? So, hold on. This is three mana. Yeah, and let's kill him. 31. Perfect. And he should kill himself pretty much if he hits me, right? Oh, yeah. He's dead. Wonderful. So now we need an offensive card, and the enemies skip their entire turn, which is good. Lovely. Okay, so we're gonna do... How can we do this, actually? I'm gonna kill... Bat, like this. Nice. And then... Hmm. 90 damage. This is good. This is really good. Bye, dude. You're donezo. Okay, guys. We're doing good so far. I think this is gonna be it for this episode. And if you guys like this game, keep following. I'll put up another episode soon. So, please, give it a like. If you did like it, comment down below what you think about the game. And please, subscribe to, the my, to my YouTube channel so you could get notified when I push out another YouTube video. I'll see you guys in the next episode.